All right, so we got game trailers in 2023 versus 2012. Let's get into the video. 2012 was a really good year, in my opinion. Neo Berlin. This is the place. A crime. Th this is something a, like this. This is the frame rate from like the actual trailer. I was right. Okay. Call this man Batman, bro. What does this tell the viewer? Okay. Nice couple jabs in an uppercut. A little Lamborghini type thing. Okay. I think 10 is the perfect value. Value. Hey, for a 2012 trailer, this don't. Hey, you know what? They showing off gameplay though. Bro, they're showing off gameplay. They, they hired Chat. Chat. <laughs> Bro, they showing off gameplay. That's something that a lot of trailers nowadays won't do. Pray so loud. I don't know if you guys can hear me or not. Twelve FPS trailer. Hey, they showing off gameplay. I mean, it is twelve FPS. But at the same time, they're showing off gameplay. You gotta respect it. So I was forced to do this. Rated M for mature. Wait, that was the one in 2023? This is, yeah, this is the Halo trailer. Master Chief, bro. He got him held like these, like a trophy. Huh? Which one did better? Uh, Halo. And I'm uh, uh Halo. I almost cried right there, bro. Master Chief, the goat. Um, okay. First of all, that caught me off guard. I thought the trailer that was going 12, 12 frames per second was the one in 2012. I didn't know. I mean, okay, hold up. Okay, hold up. You could say two things about this, right? You could say that, okay, yeah, back then, uh, you know, trailer, blah, blah, blah. Okay. My take about this is you could say that, that, a, that this trailer, that the beginning, that this trailer in 2023, you could say that this trailer right here, you could say that you picked the that you picked the wrong trailer. You could say that though. So the person that created this video, right? I, I've never watched your channel before, right? So, but you could say that you picked, you know, a not so good, not so fluid, a not so um, impactful trailer. You could say that, right? I think we all could say that. That you picked out of all trailers, because let's be real, there were a lot of good trailers. Um, let's say, for example. Uh, let's let's go uh, the quarry right from 2022 even though that's not in 2023 let's just you know let's just go by uh, the quarry trailer right the quarry trailer I thought was really good uh, it looked clean uh, and it, like it teased the viewer cool that that's my like standard for a good trailer a good trailer is a good gaming trailer is uh, a trailer that can really uh, catch eyes or uh, you know just make everybody look at it for once uh, well for the first time uh, make people excited for the game. Some trailers like to, you know, throw in a little bit of gameplay, which I like. Me personally, I like when trailers do that, in my opinion. Some people don't like it. Some people see it as like spoiling, whatever. 
which makes sense. Uh, it really depends on the game. But um, but for me, a good trailer is you know um, it, it's it's eye catching. Uh, it, it makes you want, like really want to play the game. It, it kind of teases you basically. That's that's my version of a really good trailer. Um, this trailer, the 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 one in twenty twenty three right here. This trailer was um, even though the frame like the frame rate was uh was kind of bad. I still respected that they showed gameplay because I like that. Some people, a lot of people don't. I like it. Um, but the trailer itself, when it came down to the like, you know the resolution and you know the frame rate, you know it wasn't really that um appeasing to a lot of people's eyes. Uh, when it came down to the Halo one, Halo is just such a it, it's just such a good game franchise, bro. It's it's it, it's Halo. That's number one. Number two. Um, I mean, obviously, I think the Halo one did better, bro. Like, I'd even talk during the Halo one. Like, I was just stunned the entire time. So, like, at the end of the day, when it came down to it, you could just say you picked a terrible trailer for the 2023 one, and you picked a really good one for 2012. You could say that, though. You could. I'm sorry, I just spit everywhere. You could say that, though, for real, honestly, because you could have found a really good trailer uh, in 2023. You could have. You could have used um, one for, you could have used the trailer for um, uh, Atomic Heart. You could have used the one for even the, even the newest game that's out, um, uh, Resident Evil. You could have used, you know, but at the same time, I get what you're trying to say. Um, trailers back then did bang. I would say that. Um, some really good examples. Uh, Last of Us, that trailer was good. I, I remember that one. Uh, GTA 5. Uh, trailer i i literally i can literally like give you the setting of like what was going on whenever i watched that trailer on the tv i watched that trailer on the tv um and, and so yeah that's how big that game like was going to be like the like the hype around gta 5 was absolutely crazy they had that they had that trailer on, on tv uh, they had people on the radio talking about it. it like the hype around that game was crazy and again i think that's what makes a, a really good I mean, obviously, it makes a really good game, but I, I think the, the trailer itself is what hooks people. I think, like, I, I feel like I feel like a gaming trailer is a necessary, right? It, it really is a necessary because some games just drop without no trailer, no nothing. Some games drop and they do really good, right? Uh, but when it comes down to it, I feel like if you really want your game to like get as much traction as it can, get people excited you know, tease a little bit so people can be hooked on it, like, day one. Obviously, a gaming trailer is, it, 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 you know, it's the, best, it's the best thing, you know, you can do. So, when it comes down to it, I feel like, I don't know, man. I feel like uh, there were a lot of good trailers this year. Even though we're four months in, there were a lot of good trailers uh, this year. Um, obviously, you, <laughs> you picked this one because this... <laughs> I mean, I don't blame you, but at the same time. You know, you could have picked a good trailer, but it is what it is. Comment down below what you guys think uh, of this video. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and like the video if you guys didn't like my reaction and like my little TED talk or whatever. Other than that, I'll see you guys later for the next one. I'm out and.